Oh, uh -oh. so it's a cloud ditto. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Did you really? Cool. Sick. All right. Uh, I'm not really sure who said it. I wasn't really paying attention. Looking for uh, looking Instant for the down result. B. Let's see it. Yeah. <laughs> Lightning quiz is mad. Damn Demeter. But... I, I, I'm going to assume this ditto is basically entirely neutral. Just a lot of like spacing and whoever just basically has the better fundies here. Um, this Cloud is like a very fundies based character. Uh, if you have really good fundies as Cloud, you can do a lot. Hmm. Of course, yeah, you have I mean, to, you know, be good with limit management and stuff like that. Yeah, like your neutral that, is yeah. more than just a bear now. Yeah. So you definitely need to uh, know what you're doing with Cloud. And it's so weird when you're talking about how, uh, you know, the differences between Smash 4 and Ultimate and everyone thought that Cloud was a really bad character now. It's, no, you just you just can't uh, just do honest. everything with up air anymore. That's all it is. But Limit Break Cross Slots is going to connect. That move take, has always uh, been meaty. Yeah. So, I mean, that is... Uh, the more things change, the more they stay the same. Ain't that right, Roy? <laughs> Definitely. That'll be at a shield there. A lot of uppies. We're going to see a lot of uppies, I feel like, this set. Um, you can... I think it's like frame five. It's such mm. a good just move to just say, get off me, stop doing things. As I say that, there you go. There's an uppie and a nice. He read the, the air dodge down and got the fair. So this is looking actually pretty even, so more or less. Another uppie, no punish. I mean, ostensibly, it's uh, it's even. It really is just a matter of who's going to land that killing blow first, but also the management of Limit Break. I feel Seven is maybe just a little too antsy on the trigger finger if they can build it up. That's one there thing. Go, there's Limit for quiz. Lightning. Yeah, gets it. Doesn't run into that. Good patience there by Seven to not approach at the ledge. However, Lightning Quiz catches Seven standing flat-footed a little bit too long. They will be punished with their first stock. Seven's gonna try and probably fish for a nuff smash here, maybe try to catch lightning jumping or something like that. Nuff smash is a very good just move. It, it, it hits behind Cloud. It, sometimes you just throw it out and it hits. Um, so let's see if, ooh, nice dash tag. Definitely a good move now. Well, it was good before, but it, it kills a lot earlier now. Now we're gonna be evened up here. Just about even limit on deck for seven. Ooh, the last hit of cross that? flash. Ooh, no tech. Yeah, Lightning Quiz kind of getting batted around here. Seven, with a little bit of wind in their sails, going to try to carry it forward, but uh, Lightning Quiz all of a sudden feels pressed to uh, press buttons, and I'm not really sure how that uh, plays in their favor at all, especially with nice. Seven showing that they are willing to be patient with it. And even up, basically even up, they were, I think, almost like 0.7% apart then, but as, almost as I said that, now suddenly Lightning Quiz has turned it around so fast. That limit is just, just a game changer. It's... Basically go, just whenever you want. Yeah, it's, it's go except you can charge it. It's uh, pretty neat at the very least, but... Why does Cloud get fighting game meter? Oh, <clears throat> uh, don't speak that into existence, thank you. But <laughs> it's uh, Lightning Quiz going to make it back to the stage via the air dodge and shields it. Shields don't the, punish uh, that back, that was actually punishable. Because uh, he drifted into Lightning Quiz there. There we go, same situation as first stock here. It was... Not too much of a difference in percent, and then uh, we saw a stock take, I think, from seven first. No, it was Lightning Quiz. Lightning Quiz first, yeah. But... So right now, yeah, as I was saying, it's kind of coming down to neutral. Whoever's getting the most neutral interaction. Ooh. Yeah, that neutral B always catches people on the ledge when they stay too long. Yeah, but seven, I mean, that's the sort of thing that you should know. You know this character, man. But either way, seven, gonna try to catch a jump, reading it. It's gonna make Lightning Quiz get up uh, neutrally. And they're going to be uh, conditioning this for a long, Ooh, long he time, goes hopefully it, trying to build up that pops. meter. They're going to have a dance off stage and uh, no casualties just yet. However, it's seven off the ledge right now and trying to get back to center stage. I think Chris has definitely got the better ledge trapping. My man has got him stuck in the corner looking like Ken. Yeah, just a little bit. And that's a big old wind up lightning quiz is uh toying with seven at the moment Ooh, wrong way that may be full stock lead back here is going to put him in a disadvantage might be looking for the down air to finish it off doesn't get the spiking hitbox but nice. the dash attack dash is attack. going to finish it off i think he could have di'd that too just barely yeah that's one of those points of contention there that uh we're going to have to leave up to the uh to the crowd to decide either way Cloud pop quiz also. hot shot who's up one nil 
Lightning going to take that first game. I, I'd say pretty convincingly at the end there. I think that was kind of almost a download complete. He plugged in the land cable. Yeah, just a little bit. Certainly plugged in and uh, got that download speed test. They are ready to go. Lightning Quiz and 7. Uh, well, I mean, Lightning Quiz is it, not for lack of 7's trying, but certainly uh, the game at the ledge, I don't think it was 7's recovery that was lacking. It's really just a... Uh, when you're cloud and disadvantage, you're going to have a bad time. It is what it is. But definitely credit where credit is due. Lightning Quiz never made a single uh, effort on recovery easy for Seven. Definitely not. Yeah, Lightning Quiz definitely got the better of the lead trapping situations. He got a lot of damage off of it. And I think that helped out in clear, uh, taking the game. So let's see if uh, Seven can maybe change around his lead tra trapping or just in general his game plan. Because we saw a lot of uppies from Seven at the beginning of the game. Uh, he was very trigger happy compared to Quiz, who was more uh, rolling, grabbing out of shield rather than uppies. I mean, it makes you wonder, maybe you're going to see uh, someone who can break zones a little bit more easily come out for seven. One of those pockets that we have, I think they are known to play an Inkling and a Diddy on occasion, among other characters. But those seem to be the characters that uh, would come to mind that might readily help just a little bit uh yeah definitely just a little bit here uh inkling's effectiveness online notwithstanding because you don't really see that all that often i, I think ditto's is like ditto matchups are just so can be so difficult for both players but when uh if you can obviously tell one guy has kind of got it down better than you so then you're at that point where you go well may it's not probably not going to work out if i i keep doing the ditto so you get that decision where you have to make, well, do I stay, you know, the character and try to play out the data, or do I make the switch and then potentially lose? So this could be uh, a pretty big decision here for Seven. See, I, I have to disagree with that on a fundamental level, Rorta, because just speaking as a speaking as a competitor in general, you're not playing to not lose. You're playing to win, and if you're playing uh, the former way. And frankly, competition ain't the place for you. And Seven will be playing to win. You want to talk about zone breaking? How about zone making? Out comes one Samus Aron to try to counteract Cloud at Pokemon Stadium. I think this is definitely a, a good pick. Probably wants to get Cloud off stage and then try to just end his recovery there. Which would probably be the game plan in general if you're fighting against Cloud because his recovery is very linear. Um, so I, I definitely agree with this pick. Just he has to play the matchup correctly. Oh, I agree. Grab the shield, the grab. Grab. They're slow. Yeah, and that's uh, that's a big thing. You really have to be careful with those grabs. It's not nearly as quick as uh, when it was with Cloud, and I wouldn't even say that they're known for that uh, part of their game plan either. You do have a little bit more of an option in terms of recovery. Nice Maybe this is to limit uh, Cloud's ledge trapping potential that Lightning Quiz has been so happy to put on display. Not going to connect with the back air, however. Up till it's going to connect... 4-7, nice and now come trap. the combos, there, Rota. That was definitely a nice frame trap with the missile. Um, Lightning is very patient. He, he's kind of waiting until to see what 7 does, and then just kind of reacting to it at ledge. Um, I, I don't think we should count 7 out yet, because Samus of Rage can be a pretty big monster, especially if you hit like by a back air or an S-Bash. Just like say that. He's off stage. Ooh, not going to get him. Just barely misses the 4 there. And you relinquish stage control, making Lightning Quiz press buttons to their credit Ooh. and seven going to try to keep them off stage maybe down nice air spike. and the big sweeping down air that power suit hits hard and even though lightning quiz evens it up with the back air after seven gets themselves popped up we even up at two apiece and that was a convincing first stock from nice seven. Air dodge reed gonna get the conversion there already at 68 percent for seven not looking too good there but samus isn't light either so this isn't that bad I believe Seven yeah. doesn't even have a charge yet on his neutral B, so low on resources here. Seven's gonna have to try and win a neutral interaction here to get the time to charge up his uh, neutral B and get I moving. I mean, this is how you shift the momentum after getting spiked. Oh just my God! The, uh, just at the ledge. To get a zero death? Oh, come to his curse. Uh, not quite. Yeah, so that grab is going to squash that dreams. But that was their first hit since they uh, spiked Lightning Quiz at the ledge, and since then. It's been all lightning quiz in terms of the offensive measures. Oh, he's gonna try to keep jump. it going. Gonna try to read a jump with the back air and connect nice. seven to get the roll and lightning quiz. Gonna say you're gonna get into the air whether you want to or not. Otherwise, you're getting up smashed. 
Lightning Quiz. Definitely a player who can uh, adapt and just start downloading. This man's got a pretty fast download speed right now because he is figuring out 7 at the ledge and that's take, getting him so much damage. Like I was saying last game, but here it's just way more apparent. He's trying to really figure out 7 here and 7's not really getting much of a chance to play the game. Oh, that could have been it. I think an up B would have been a better option there. Maybe get a Suicide Spike. Back air is going to connect for seven as they try to get more points on the board, but right now facing a full stock deficit at the hands of Lightning Quiz. Advantage State gonna try to look for that down air, maybe getting a little bit chancy. Gonna connect with the fair, keep an advantage state. And yeah, limit break comes in at just the right time for Lightning Quiz. Seven's not out of it just yet. Nice pair into the upbeat. Ooh, stops his back air of his own. Yeah, that, that could have been that. it for a seven if he hit that back. That back air was hit. Yeah, but uh, stuffs it out, and uh, you just outframed them, and that's kind of what you need to do. Figure out which buttons work the best, especially when you have a sword that hits so heavy and uh, so effectively. Charge jump, shot, not no read. They were trying to read a jump, but uh, good nice. read out by Lightning Quiz. This is looking pretty, uh, pretty grim for seven. Yeah, sitting at 122, you need uh, you need to stuff out a recovery after you claim this stock. The question is, how are you taking this thing? Jeez, Looking for a grab at ledge, here. I would imagine. No up throw either. Down throw. Surprisingly, no up throw. Oh, he jumps right into it. Yeah. Sitting at 151, that might kill Pokemon Stadium being the lowest uh, Ooh, no, being the lowest oh, ceiling in the game, seven, and you're missing. Seven, five, out. Up throw there. And that's going to take them down to their last stock. Full charge seven. shot. This could be a yeah, big turn around. Oh. No, you're missing on grabs, and Lightning Quiz is going to make you pay for it. I think Seven's definitely kind of panicking here, maybe breaking down a bit. But now Back Lightning Quiz is going to rush in and press buttons all day because no you do not have charge shot to worry about. And yeah, you roll that, you get the forward tilt, and that's going to win you advantage. Seven is going to eat the back air, and they are going to have to eat a 2-0 defeat at the hands of Lightning Quiz. Seven definitely got nervous there at the end. Uh, he was missing a lot of punishes and, and making uh, some... Look like he missed inputs there. He did like a, an up tilt the wrong way. Um, and that, that's what happens in a high-stress match when, you know, when you're just about to die from one hit and you got to play just about perfect. Not everybody can do it. Um... So great work to both players, especially Lightning. Just honestly taking control of the set and just adapting to uh, what Seven was doing and reaction to uh, being at the ledge and stuff like that. And Quiz was just so good at capitalizing off of that. It's a. Uh, it wasn't a bad. Uh, wasn't a bad showing by Seven at all, especially in that game number two. It was last we, stock. Yeah. It was last stock, but yeah, it was a uh, a pretty decent showing there from the from the Samus. Definitely posing some questions to Lightning Quiz, but as their uh, as their name might indicate, it was Lightning Quiz posing even more questions to Seven, and uh, that was a problem that they simply could not solve in time. Just taking too much damage on that second stock, watching it accumulate all the way up to 141. And you were talking, Rorta, about how it might have been a zero to death. What did Lightning Quiz do so effectively that let them take back the momentum of the set after getting I, I, I said before that Lightning.